Hey guys, what is up? It's the Raw Report 20 here, and welcome back to The Walking Dead, where this time we will be finishing the game on episode 5. Well, we'll be finishing the season on episode 5, uh, no time left. And, uh, we'll see where all our actions have taken us. Let's, uh, let's get it going. All of them, and then, boom, no time left. Alrighty. And then we can move on and we'll blow through the 400 days DLC. It shouldn't be too long. I think it's about an hour and a half, maybe, for all five characters and your finale. Previously and on The Walking Dead. Season two. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. But we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> yeah, why? Clementine? Clementine! Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Maybe you should stay with the boat. Oh, okay, sure. Clementine! So actually, it was an accident telling Ben to stay behind, but I just ran out of time. And I hit the one that I thought was right, and it wasn't. So, whatever. Ben stayed back. It really, really does not matter much to me. This game series adapts to the choices you make, and tailors to the way you play. And is tailored to the way you play. I think I mess that up every single time I start. Urratan. Urratan. Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here! All I want is the girl! Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt! Hmm. Clementine, are, are you alright? No, I'm Where sure are she's you? fine. She's fine. Burning, you son of a bitch! Cody! Where have you taken her? This isn't Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Fuck you! You're fucking dead! I don't know who you are, but I will kill you! Do you understand? I know you will. She knows you will. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, bye. Well... You better not fucking hurt her. I swear. Well, we just got into it, so... Don't worry, pal. We'll get it. Let's back. begin. Also, zombies. We were kind of loud, and lots of zombies. How's that feeling? It doesn't matter. It is what it is. We don't have much time. Really? Man, they got in here fast, without us noticing. We're about to have a lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets in. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. Try to find another way out of here. I will. Oh, hey. A scale. Um, surgical supplies. Just some surgical supplies. Hmm. What do we got in here? A whopping nothing. Congratulations on your nothing, sir. Would you like that to go? Yes, in fact, I would. Yeah. Uh, not sure. A rib spreader. Ew. Looks like a car jack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. I'm sure it's medical procedure. Anything else we got? Nope. More nothing. More whopping nothing. Alrighty. Well, we better head up and around to see if there's anything else. 
an elevator shaft. <laughs> bang! Bang! Yeah, just shoot the thing. It'll work. Uh, let's use the rib spreader on it. There we go. Now you, uh, you do I'll this. I'll have these doors open in two seconds. Even less than that, if you would stop talking and start opening. I'm just kidding now. Uh, uh, uh. Uh oh, Lee, Lee, stay with me. Come on, man. Don't do this. Come on, man. Stay with me. And he's gone. Oh, never mind. He's not. He's not done yet. Not done yet. Not. Not yet. Not. Oh, never mind. It, oh. Uh. And there we go. Episode five. <laughs> Episode five. No time left. Fuck. Is he alive? I'm fine, guys. I'm fine. Okay. This has to be done. Sorry, pal. I gotta do it. Well. Whoa. Whoa! Stop! He's awake! He's still bitten. So? This is about trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. Chopping his arm off. Do we know it works? We don't know anything. We know there's gonna be a lot of blood. There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What if he dies? Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. <laughs> Let's go. I'm more than down to remove an arm. Maybe it'll work. It's a big risk. Yeah. We're down here without a lot of options. Fuck it! Off with his arm! Fuck it. Cut it off. Seriously. Yeah. I don't have anything to drink. I just realized. It'll be over before you know. Oh, before you know it. Just gotta get through. Mm. It was easier when I thought he was out. Oh, Jesus. Fine. I'll go as fast as I can. Fast would be good. Look, you're gonna- ah! Try to stay still! Ah! Ah! Oh, God! I know! That was an interesting scene. Hello, Chris. How are you? Uh, uh, fuck. Uh, it worked! Uh, I'm now... I now have a stump. Shit. Did they just leave me? Holy hell. We Tired from work, me? You. Tired from being Even sick again? Man. Uh, my arm is on fire. Uh, good riddance. It's so bad. But maybe Doc got more time. Do you think you'll be able to travel? You lost some blood. I mean, do we have a choice? Yeah. Good. The elevator's open. Let's go. So, uh... I'll bring up the rear. I don't want to bleed over. How's the, uh, how's the new job going for you? I thought I was ringing up the rear. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor or even the roof. That was a rather gruesome scene, I know. Yeah. It was a perfect one for, for parents to walk in on. Such a good scene. Quiet, he says as he's talking. Oh, we're just getting away. Jesus Christ, Lee. Ah! So what happened to the being quiet? I mean, I, I know it would be rather scary, but...
All right, Grace, you gotta understand. The way I see it is if someone's watching The Walking Dead, they have to know what's in the game. Well then. Watch out! That was fucking cool. I like how I said watch out after it literally passed Just fucking everyone. Peachy. Stop swearing at me, I'm a cripple. You making fun of a, a cripple? Trying to get used to the systems and whatnot. Interesting. Very interesting. Indeed. Yes. Quite. You know, a lot of zombies are in this building very, very quickly. Like, you see, if I was playing, like, Mario Kart or something, I'd probably put it to mature audiences. But I'm playing The Walking Dead. Like, it's got dead in the name. You gotta be ready to see some stuff. Plus, I don't know. Very few younger... Well, no. Very few people that are that I see as too young to actually see this are, uh... On Twitch. Remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. There must be thousands of them. They didn't follow us here, did they? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. They can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Maybe we can wait for an opening. We could be waiting a long time. Still, Lee's right, and that we gotta pick our time and go. Anybody know how far and in what direction the mansion is? We probably ought to start there. It's between us and River Street, so we can stop if we have to. Retrace our steps, maybe. And they get going towards the hotel where Clem's parents were staying. Okay. Look, let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. I... Uh, don't think we can ignore what just happened to Lee. He lost but, a lot of blood down why there. you gotta stare at my cripple arm? Why you gotta make me feel different? If you find yourself getting winded, or worse, you gotta let us know. Shit happens, man. Come on. Screw that, I'm fine. I look like I need any preferential treatment. Well... You could have taken my damn leg down there. Wouldn't have slowed me down a bit. You <laughs> hear me? Lee yeah. goes hard sometimes. But, uh... You know what? We get down and we find a little girl out there. Right, pal? Now, let's get our bearings. This is the beginning of this episode. There's five episodes in this season. There's the beginning of this episode, so it's technically just starting, but it's the very last episode, so it's also at the end. It's an extension ladder. It's also covered in paint. <laughs> Both arms and legs. Look like I give a shit. Nah, bruh. Nah. Got up that ladder with my teeth. What's up, Kenny? That looks like Crawford Square over there. That is Crawford Square. Fuck that place. Ew. Did fix up Man. our boat, though. Look how low quality those get trees are right there. Get right back. Please. Make sure she wears her life jacket, okay? PC Master Race, please. Something tells me she's not gonna want to. That looks like Crawford Square over there. We already went over this. Yeah, it does look like Crawford Square. Wait, I'm not done. What's this ladder do? Here's a way down. Yeah, nope. <laughs> yeah, if half the dead population of Georgia wouldn't wander in the streets down there. Fully <laughs> department check? Yep, screw that. They hired, like, they probably hired me for that job, and I just didn't know, because that's about as much as I could do. He or she walked away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. Huh. Well, that looks like fun. Oh, huh, fun. Quite, yes, mm hmm indeed. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should they be hired just They hired No, they hired me, bro. We need to head back. Even chimps there. could do better than we'll I could when it comes the mansion, to... Like you said, and make sure we art. don't overlook it. <laughs> yeah. Or at least digital art. figure out a way to get there. 